Good day, I'm Jamel Panogao and this is my thesis titled Scattering of Sigma C Plus and D-Bar with Tensor Component. Much of history, the atom was considered to be an elementary particle until subatomic particles were discovered. As we zoom into the center, we see the nucleus, which is composed of protons and neutrons. The proton and neutron were classified as hadrons. More hadrons have been discovered through history. Hadrons are thought to be made of smaller particles, called quarks, which have been experimentally proven. However, we haven't observed a loose quark. The quark configuration of a hadron determines its properties, as stated by the conventional quark model. The quark model classified hadrons into two, mesons and baryons. A limitation that the conventional quark model has is that it violates the Pauli's exclusion principle. This is where the color charge comes in, which then led to the widely accepted theory for strong interaction, quantum chromodynamics. In modern times, hadron interactions are done in a hadron collider. However, we do not completely know how these hadrons interact. In this study, we modeled the interaction using this diagram, where the vertex is described by the coupling parameter lambda Alpha is the state before the interaction, and beta is the state after the interaction. We attempted to describe this diagram using the separable potential model. The separable potential model is differentiated by its regulator, which in this study we refer to as the form factor. We've structured this study by first producing poles for different cases. Poles appear due to the interactions inherited in the dynamics of the underlying theory. We then determine the behavior of each interaction by interpreting the T-matrix.